telling you, and I say this with no sense of arrogance at all, I don't care how you take it. I have never had a liberal challenge me any time. Mr. Call Screener, tell me I'm making this up, right? If I'm lying, call me out on the air. What did I tell you during the break? If you get a liberal, put him to the front of the line. Did I not say that? There you go. Thank you. Put him to the front of the line. There are probably 50 to 60 million diehard liberals in the country. Call at any time, 877-381-3811. I take all comers here, all of them, because I know what you're going to say is stupid. And I know that conservatism and that our ideas actually work and that you're just going to make crap up. I know. That's why I say throw the liberals right to the front. Throw them in there. Throw them in there to throw my egg and bring back the old queens in. Because what you're saying is crazy. That this is like this liberal student who doesn't understand that his question disappeared with this man of oh, liberalism and terrorism. But they don't get that. Because that's what they believe. That we are all a bunch of stupid intellectual dreams. And if you would just turn them, uh, turn it over to elected Democrats who will appoint some PhD and, and what do you say, lesbian dance theory, that all of it, I'm not making it up, it's in the sound code. That if we would just appoint those people, and we would be a far better place, we could get rid of all the great unwashed out there. They think we're all a bunch of stupid hayseeds. Even Shapiro was a Harvard lawyer. He doesn't even have the right to comment. Bernie Sanders is introducing a single-payer plan where government people, government bureaucrats, and elected imbeciles. You know, I, I heard, this was a line, right? I, forgive me again, I forget who said this, but there was a congressman once who said he spent the first year shocked that he got elected and the rest of his time in Congress shocked that everybody else got elected. He's, listen, I'm sorry. I, 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 I'm a, I am a Christian. I'm a sinner like everyone else. I respect you for your manhood or womanhood, and you all have big all rights. You're all touched by the hand of God in life. But that does not mean you're a genius. And these people up on the hill think they are geniuses. They want to run every aspect of your life while simultaneously saying you're too stupid to do it, while they elect really stupid people on their side who then appoint other people who think they're going to run your entire life and nothing's going to go wrong or we're not going to break anything. That's what single payer is. What do you think single payer is? What, by the way, for those liberals out there, kooks, who believe in single payer, who do you think the single payer is? Uh, the, the government. Uh, the government? What does the government produce? What is the government? Like Apple or IBM? It produces like government computers? The government gets its money from who? The government gets its money from you. The joke of single payer, and by the way, the joke is on you. The joke of single payer is you're the single payer while the government's the single distributor. While kooky liberal Ben Shapiro question asker asks people, well, Ben, you're not really smart enough to be.